Index cards. Index cards. And these are my important stuff right here. <laughs> and um, this is my trash can. And this is my blue thingy. Mama, look at see. This is my blue thing. And this is the lovely compressor. <laughs> oh yeah, that is lovely. So what do you do here? How do you do school? We, you do online public school? Uh -huh. We sit on these chairs and then we... That's awesome. You have a really cool desk. Yeah, buddy. And a cute little vampire. Yeah, a little Halloween decoration for fun. So this is where Tag sits, and he does school, and we keep, look, he's got some handwriting books, oh. his phonics stuff, and then over here we have more books in the drawers, and this is his history drawer with all his books and stories. Then he has some putty and crayons and stuff. Here, buddy, back up. Show him what's in the middle drawer. Mostly nothing. Well, you have your blocks and things that you can put together when you need a little bit of help focusing during school, right? You can pay attention and build quietly with blocks while we go through the lessons. Yes, we love UB school supplies. You guys, show me, what's this wall here? Our checklist. Let me square. Each star it means that we completed one year. Yes, so we make these checklists so that they can see how many units of each subject they have to do and they can put stickers each time they finish a unit and then it kind of helps all of us feel like we're accomplishing something throughout the year and they can visibly see their progress anytime they need a little encouragement. And then this shelf. Yep, the shared shelf. Yep, science and math. And a whole bunch of books. And then tag science and math also. This Goggles. is my temperature. Yeah, K-12 does a great job providing the materials Mom, that we need for school. At no cost because it is online public school, so that's really helpful. We just buy the extra school supplies that we need, like crayons and binders and... Highlighters. We do a lot of UB school supplies because <laughs> goofball. <laughs> we like the UB school supplies <laughs> because they provide um, school supplies to other classrooms. Whenever you buy another item for them, so pretty much except for our crayons and markers, everything is UB. Lucy, show. Let's show them your desk. My desk has three lovely Harley Davidsons. <laughs> I have sugar skulls like everywhere. And some art projects. Some books. And a little sign. The lovely Lucy there. And what is, oh, you're learning cursive this it's year. Cursive. Their school still requires cursive handwriting, which we love that.
squishy ball. Squishy ball when you need a little stimulation and or relaxation. My pencils with scissors. Binders, handwriting stuff, and notebooks, and an extra checklist that the school sent, and my binders, beautiful binders. More UB school supplies that we use to put each subject in whenever we're done with the workbooks. And voila! I have the unicorn stickers and fish. Fish <laughs> from a science project. <laughs> yes. Um, and I shoved some in some in a in, in a um, and I shoved shoved some of the fish in the um. Okay. Okay. That's what I little brothers do. A cute little pencil pencil sharpener. <laughs> Some <laughs> colored, more colored pencils. More markers. Cute little erasers. I have a troll and an apple. And we have some paint. literature books here. Paint. And this is their language arts shelf down here with their writing skills and language and vocabulary books all provided within the curriculum from k-12 so this is their awesome school room i would have loved to have had a school room like this whenever i was a kid i mean it's pretty awesome do you guys like learning in here yes What's your favorite subject in school? <gasps> Science! History and art. Art too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, art's always good. Art's always awesome. So anyway, Bye. YouTube, <laughs> this is oh. our school room. And I forgot to mention too, each room in our house has a Disney theme. And for this one, we thought it would be fun to do Meet the Robinsons because of its themes with learning and moving forward. And I found this cute little print that says, It's been a long, hard day full of emotional turmoil and dinosaur fights. Which, if you've tried to teach young kids before who are different ages and different grades, you know that's fairly accurate. So, <laughs> my slap bracelet ruler. All right, say bye. Thanks bye -bye. for coming to visit our schoolroom. Bye-bye, YouTube.